How are we doing? Um, I've got to be a bit quiet on this one. Right? Um, I'm back on that little village tip I did my last video on. And um, I tried to get on it a couple of days ago when it was still light and I got chucked off. I didn't seem to actually get a shovel in the ground. So um, I've come back now and it's well, nearly night time. It'll be getting dark soon. So I've um, got on the lights and everything. So this one's um, going to be a night dig. I just want to see if anything's going to come out of this tip because it's got potential. I mean, the, pack, the, the bit I've picked here could be the worst bit on the tip. So um, I'm going to carry this all going that way and then hopefully another time if I'm getting along as I don't have no trouble tonight I'm going to go the opposite way and like a bit of a team and just see if anything better is going to come out of it but yeah, uh, night dig time anyway so First bottle here Powell's City Sauce A bit beat up I'm afraid by the look of that. Yeah, it's got some cracks in that has. There's your first bottle anyway. Something else here. I can't remember what these are, but they are something meat extract, I think. Bottle there. Playing, I'm afraid, but decent age, which is good. All right, the ash is slowly changing as I'm moving forward, it's changing in um, the color and what's in it. I mean, you probably can't tell the difference at all because obviously night lighting tends to wash everything out but it's definitely changing from this horrible light grey light stuff to more ash I've got a bottle here still inside nothing special but um, everything's coming out of the labels on and it's just Much better ash. You see that? Definitely is changing. So um, I'm going to keep at it a bit longer. It looks like the further that way I'm going, the better the ash is. Just need to get some decent bottles at it now. Right, I've been at this tip for ages now, and I'm not getting anything. It's uh, very strange. I'm hitting like a layer of just solid lumps of coal see me here just massive chunks of coal now i always thought in the victorian times there was always how can i say i've seen photos and pictures now where these kids picking coal off the streets and stuff you see it all there it's just solid coal which is very unusual i've got a, a bottle here i'm going to pull out in a minute but um a very weird tip I think it's actually more industrial than um, household because I'm certainly not getting many bottles out it that or it's been um, picked through but um, I know it's only about seven foot deep anyway so um, I can do all that tonight anyway so I'm gonna go all the way to the bottom like I say there's there's all sorts in it, just nothing bottles. But uh, where is it? 
We're going to have to pull this out anyway. Ooh, it's green. Nice one. Nice, nice poison. Much better than the usual ones. Yeah, I'm happy with that. And it's not cracked either because everything I've had up to yet has been damaged. I'll just get that clean up on my jeans. Yeah. Very nice poison that. I can't look at if that's cracks in the neck or what. No, I don't think they are. They're just, you know, more like stress fractures you get in them sometimes. At least I've got something anyway. But uh, it's about half past nine anyway, so I'm going to keep going. Big old lid here. Now, hopefully, I'll find the rest of it when I come caving it in. A bit of luck, I find the rest of that. It's got a bloody hole in it, isn't it? Got a bottle right buried down here. Uh, yeah, we're still getting this out. I can't even feel any embossing on it. And uh, I think it's going to be an horrible wine bottle actually, because that is going a lot. <coughs> a lot longer than a beer. All that for that. That's early though. That is. This tip is a weird tip because that is. Um, that's quite early. It looks like it's a little tip which has been used for a long, long time because the deeper I go, the earlier the stuff is because that's an early neck. Pity is nothing on it though. I think I've actually got a beer here. Yeah. R. L. Jones, Mansfield. Um, actually, it's quite a nice dumpy shape that one is. What the stopper says, a minute. Hardy and Martin. I'm just going to say, um, I don't know if it's just where I'm iron, but I seem to find bottles all the time with odd stoppers on the top. But uh, yeah, nice local beer anyway. And what's inside it? But. Uh, yeah, picking up a tiny bit now, caving in early. So at least I'm not gone home completely empty handed. But, um, yeah, carry on caving a bit more. See if anything else comes out. Right, I'm giving up on this hole. There's, there's nothing in it. There's no beers, there's no sauce bottles. There's not the usual household stuff that usually you'll find all the time. No ink wells, there's nothing, no marmalades. There's um, it's just lots of coal and it looks like industrial waste. Now, I know I've had that poison which is quite nice, but even that, it might have been something to do with the factories, some sort of chemical in it or something. I mean, people think that because it's got poison on there was poison bottles, there weren't. It was just anything that was toxic. 
it could have been something to put on your toenails or it could have been some chemical for you know what I mean dying or etching something in the factory it's simply they had poison on them but everybody knows them now as poison bottles but um, yeah I'm gonna cave the sides in and um, and see if anything comes out but I don't think it is I think this is all industrial waste but um, I'm good up on this tip yet like I say there's loads more to go at and I'm gonna go completely the opposite side this time and see if that changes because this is um, not good at all it's not worth a night dig anyway but um, yeah I'm gonna cave all the sides in if um, if anything if I find anything obviously you'll see it but um, yeah let's get caving in well oh hang a minute I'm blinding you aren't I um, well can you see me yeah um, I'm busy caving in and all that stuff, I'm not getting anything like I didn't think I would because it's because it's it's like it's like it's been sieved or something. But um, where is it? I find it somewhere. Oh, there it is. Um, I think I found a blue poison there. So um, it's still in the side. I've only, I can only see the neck um, sticking out. But usually, if the neck's there, the rest of the bottle's there. So I'll do a spinny camera around and uh, I'll video it. Yeah, at least it's something. Turn this one off. Oh, we'll find where it was now. Ah, here it is. Yeah. Nice one. Yep, happy with that. Beautiful. Two poisons now. Right, that's me done for tonight. Uh, not much, I'm afraid. Two poisons, all right, and obviously the beer. But uh, yeah, very unusual tip. Can't work it out. But um, next time I'm going to go um, completely the other side of the tip, if I can find where it is anyway, and um, see if it's any better there, because this side isn't very good. But um, come out with two nice poisons anyway, look like they're going to clean up nice too. But uh, yeah, that's it for tonight, and I'm going to bed now. Till next time.